Hi guys, in this short, we'll try to learn about the exit command, which is one of the function in the jail process. So the exit command, what it will try to do it is, it will try to run this command inside a shell command. So it's inside the shell. So that means it will start the shell process and then inside the shell, it will try to run this command. So now if you try to execute the same output for this one, so if you run this thing, so let's try to run this one. So now you will be able to get this all the output. Whereas the spawn runs the executable commands only, whereas this exit runs this all things. I'll try to show you a simple example for this one. So let's say that we are having an exit function which is echo some string something I am using the translate function to convert the spaces into a newline character. Now if I try to execute this code, so if I run this thing, so it will work without any problem. So some string it is giving the output. So whereas the same thing if I try to run it in the spawn, what will happen? Let's try to see. So whereas this is the same thing I am running it in the spawn echo and we need to pass these all the arguments as a array like this. So if I run the same command here in our terminal. Now here, let's see that we are getting the same output like pipe, whatever the data we are trying to send it here, the same output we are getting it. So that means here the exit will run the command and whereas this one will not run it. 